Hello and welcome to Sefiso Twala Media. Today's topic is about the Al Ali non nonsense boss, who Mr. Mahomet El Khatib. Mr. Mahomet Khatib imposed the heavy fine to all Al Ali players, the coaches and the technical directors. Pito Musimane's team tested a defeat in Egyptian Super Cup tie with a penalty shootout loss of 3-2 to El Gash, who is believed to have secured uh, their first ever Super Cup title on Tuesday. That was last night. The boss actually imposed 281,000 rand and 529 rands. That is equivalent to 300,000 of Egyptian uh, currency. So that fine, all players of Al Ali, director of uh, football or directors of football, coaching staff, after the disappointing performance in Egyptian Super Cup on Tuesday, despite the great support that the team received to achieve titles and meet the expectations of the fans. That was actually the statement coming from Al Ali's management, directly, obviously, from the boss. That uh, the boss is not there to just have fun. He is there to make money. He is there to make sure that the fans are kept happy. I hope uh, Kaiser Chiefs and other PSL struggling teams, they're going to start uh, imposing same uh, actually um, fines to their teams and stuff, especially case achieves such a big team losing to a new coming uh, team, uh, Royal AM or the Real Kings 4-1 over the weekends. I think uh, Stuart Baxter was supposed to be fined and uh, the players also supposed to be fined, uh, fined because I mean, uh, Chiefs is one of the uh, biggest teams in South Africa and um, the great loss that happened over the weekend is unacceptable. And uh, I think uh, uh, Bobby and Kazam Taung uh, have learned a, a thing or two. So Al Ali, even the new signings, they were not spared. Uh, the, our Pesitao was not actually uh, uh, put on the side because he just uh, arrived. He was also fined. And uh, please uh, leave a comment. What do you think about... Um, the Al Ali's uh, boss, do you think what he did uh, is the right motivation for the boys to start winning games and uh, to be on the path of like winning consistently? Or do you think this is just a, a power abuse uh, or unfair lab labor practice? Please leave your comment and um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I thank you very much for your time. Hola.